I became a mentor because I had personally experienced the impact that a good mentor can have. My mentor for biology is a great example of how to really invest yourself in your education. He really convinced me to get excited about learning. He also did a great job connecting what we were learning in class with the real world. He inspired me to want to take my understanding of the material to the next level. As a mentor, I think I have given my students the knowledge and the confidence they need to succeed. Students are able to come to my sessions feeling like they don't know what they need to do or that they are going to fail. And I am able to not only help them learn the material, but empower them to believe that they are capable of success. I think that this second part is where I have made a more lasting impact on some of my former students as they continue their studies. The other impact I think I have is that I get my students to enjoy their schoolwork. I think that enjoying your schoolwork is something you can be intentional about and something you can choose to do. I try to get my students to make that choice and to get excited about what they are learning. This is one of the most valuable lessons I have learned in college. For anatomy, I think it is particularly important big picture in mind in order to reach this goal. Being interested in or excited about what you are learning makes school much more enjoyable. I think people have more control over this than they realize. I have gained some important knowledge and skills from my experience as a peer mentor. Personal academic growth and my knowledge of human anatomy and physiology has definitely helped me in my upper level classes. I am currently in a quantitative physiology class for biomedical engineering and my increased exposure and comfort with physiology has definitely helped me to succeed in that class. Mentoring has improved my interpersonal skills. Interacting with many people from many different backgrounds and walks of life has helped me a great deal in this area. I am more comfortable communicating in groups, and I also think I have grown an awareness of social dynamics in groups. I can more easily see whether people are engaged in the conversation or not. Are they having difficulty getting their thoughts or input in? Are they getting frustrated or not understanding what we are talking about? I find it easier to notice when people are disengaging, either in the class or in a conversation. Mentoring has improved this skill set because I am trying to engage my students in each of my recitations. I think this is a valuable leadership skill and it will serve me well in the future. I also think that getting a lot of positive feedback from students has really affirmed me in my abilities to teach and communicate knowledge and ideas clearly. I have gained a lot of confidence in these areas because of mentoring. My experience as a mentor has helped me develop skills that will help me in my career. As a biomedical engineer, the more I can do to improve my teamwork and communication skills, the better. Being a clear and effective communicator is absolutely essential in the engineering industry, where teamwork is central to being productive. Being able to understand and identify students' needs is another skill that will transfer well into the industry. Understanding user and customer needs is absolutely critical to being able to design and test an effective product. The mentoring program highly encourages self-reflection. I think that self-reflection is an important first step in an individual's growth. In his article, Humble and Hopeful, Welcoming First Generation Poor and Working Class Students to College, Kenneth Oldfield describes cultural capital as the knowledge, skills, education, and other advantages a person has that make the education system a comfortable, familiar environment in which he or she can succeed easily. Mentoring has helped me understand my cultural capital. It has allowed me to interact with a significantly larger slice of the student population than I would have otherwise. This increased exposure has allowed me to empathize with people more and more and made me grateful for the talent and advantages I have been given. I want to end this story by saying how grateful I am to be part of this program. I have made many new friends and feel much more connected to the campus because of it. I am honored to help in creating such a consistently positive environment on campus and thankful for a truly excellent place to work.